Next, the client project is created, and the server package of the server is loaded and downloaded to the client. The client package is therefore created first. The project editor is started. The screen resolution is set to 1024 by 736 again. And closed. The server package is now loaded. The server package has been loaded. Once again, the user settings are made in the background. The project is now closed. In the last step, the project is downloaded to the client. The server has been started in the background. The client project has been opened on the client PC. The project is now activated. The overview on the client shows the structure defined in DBA. In Tower, one picture level was created with the pictures Inc1 and Inc2. The block icons of the objects assigned to the pictures in DBA were created in both pictures. The block icons were also connected to the appropriate faceplates. Working with the faceplates is exactly the same as in standard PCS7. However, as in all the migration products, the block icons and faceplates have been adapted so that the operator recognizes the previously familiar user interface in the new HMI system. This reduces the potential for operating errors. The block icons have also been generated in Boiler. The pictures shown were generated in the background using the existing block icons on the engineering station. The new pictures were based on pictures migrated from the previous Apex Plus HMI system. When selected, the pictures are displayed with the modifications. This completes the first use case. You have seen how simple it is to configure Simatic PCS7 OS with DBA from the engineering data of Formation, the engineering tool of the Apex Plus and Quadlog process control system. The automatic sequences drastically reduce possible migration errors. As you have seen, the picture hierarchy, all tags and messages, the block icons, and their faceplates are automatically generated. It is clear from this example that using DBA and the migration products can save you time and engineering effort when migrating from your old HMI to PCS7 OS. You now know how DBA works based on the example of Apex Plus. The steps to migrate the HMI components of other process control systems are similar.